Anyway, this game doesn't have warps, so that's not going to play into it. We're just going to get started. Um, hello, Cedar. Hello, not a username. Hello, everyone, by the way. I didn't, like, say hi. Uh, this screen's a little rudimentary because it's only going to be used pretty much right now. Um, so here's the question. Who do I use? We have Blue Toad. Blue Toad, contrary to popular belief, is in the game. It does have secret exits, and I'm going to use the secret exits. Um, that's how this is going to go. Um, you vote Luigi. It's fine. Love the Mario hat. I'm glad you like it. Um, I'm looking for Luigi. Um, let's just do Luigi. Blue Todd. Oh, no. Luigi Blue Todd. Do we want a breaking vote? Anyone. Anyone. Oh, no. Have a pull? Nah. <laughs> Weegee. Weegee it is. That was the first chat. I don't know which button's A and which one's B. Oh, yeah. So this is going to be any percent, low percent. Um, ideally, this will take about an hour. Um, the reason I'm doing this with, like, the kind of world skips is because with the world skips, it's about an hour for, you know, a casual player. Without the world skips, it'll be, like, five hours. So, yeah, hat toggles hat, and I didn't add the description in because I forgot to actually, uh, put that in. That hat adds gamer skills. I was going, like, if I had, like, the red shirt and overalls, maybe, like, just as a print on a t-shirt, um, it would look a lot less MAGA-y. Um, drink water. Oh, no, I forgot to refill my... Oh. Hold on. Cutscene's still going on. I can make it. This is definitely water. Ooh, that's strong. Don't worry about it. It's water. That's backwards. Okay. Can you tell I've never worn a hat in my life? I hate wearing hats, but I, I hate wearing hats in public is more the dealio. Let's get started. Look at that. Didn't miss a beat. All right. Yeah, remember when that was unique. So let's get to it. So. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. First try. Let's do it. Just started the game. This is the first try. Yeah. So, I think the general strat here is I want to keep the squirrel suit as much as I can because it fast. Even floating, I believe, does not slow you down at all, but like using the boost jump does. So, this is going to be like a bit more like serious speedrun than the rest of the games simply because this game is so much easier to do. So, just so y'all are aware. Um, I believe I know the fastest path through the game. Um, I'm aware of most of the... Oh, look at that. Look at that. S smooth. That was a perfect run. That was a perfect level. Ah. I didn't die on 1-1 one, one in Lost Levels. Well, listen. Lost Levels is easy. Thank you for the clip. Also, I want to like do a highlight video of the 2D Mario stream because I think that would be fun. Pretty sure I want to keep the squirrel suit here. Yeah, I feel like the squirrel suit in this game to be yeah. squirrel suit in this game was a little bit uh, forgotten just because it's not as good as most other things. I'll just fly over you. 
Anyway, this is where our first secret exit's gonna come into play. Uh, it's kind of a very classic Mario-esque where, you know, second level's underground and you kind of have to go over it a bit. So I believe up here? No, was it not up here? No. It's weird because Squirrel Suit clings to walls, so I can't tell if I'm on a ledge or not. Anyway. Also, it's a lot nicer being able to use, like, an actual Pro Controller instead of, like, crappy SNES controller. Uh, is it up here, maybe? Told you I know what I'm doing. No, I definitely remember this being part of the path. I'm gonna check all of these because I really don't want to miss it. Yeah, it's right here. Because that's... Where is that for the... I think that might be for a star coin. That's for a star coin. It's a serious speed run. Listen. Listen. Pipe. It's a very serious speed run. I more mean like... That you can tell it's that this is the path. I more mean like... Wait. Wait. Yeah, there we go. See, this is so missed because of that. Just because of that. Anyway, uh, I more mean like I know the path and this game I'm probably not gonna die a million times. Didn't even get in the fight. Listen. What do you take me for? If you do use the jump, you go up really slow. It's a slow run. Maybe I can go for the slowest time. Listen, if I'm under an hour, that's a pretty good time. I believe for this game. I think the like speed run world record of this is for, I actually studied for this one. Listen, I couldn't study for like a series of five games, but I could study for this one. I believe the speed run world record is like 40 minutes or so. So I think an hour would be a good time for me. Also, there's a ton of downtime because of all these cutscenes. I believe that normally plays after you beat World 1. Since you skip so many worlds in this game, the cutscenes just kind of constantly play because they're like... It's like, oh, you got to a certain point in the game. We need to do this cutscene. And so it just keeps going on and on and on. Anyway, this level sucks. They make it like an, an underground cave level despite having like beautiful coral outside of it and I'm so angry. <gasps> Ooh! Okay, well that kind of sucks. Getting Markiplier vibes, like if something goes wrong, fun gets broken and then he has to try and recover himself as as possible. Listen, is that a- does Markiplier do the rapid succession listen? Because I swear... Like, I'm trying to stop do that stop doing that because it sounds so condescending. And it's like I wanna like try to actually admit mistakes, you know? But hey, we're gamers, we don't do that. Um, I'm considering getting this because I want a power up. It's probably just gonna be like a fire flower, but still. I just don't wanna die. Yeah. Get out of here. I already lost acorn. There's other acorns. Don't give me this. All right. I went the wrong direction. I hate bloopers. Ah! I'm going nuts. The one thing you can at least like like about this game is the bloopers don't move randomly, like in Mario Bros. One. I will blame the game. No, that's absolutely valid. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to like... So you remember Twilight Princess, right? <laughs> how, ma how many of y'all watched Twilight Princess? I'm, I'm assuming most of you. Because that was a big one. That was a long, good Let's Play. Um, yeah, I'm trying to learn from that. An exactly hour-long run would put me 63rd out of 65th. Unfortunately, I'm not keeping time on it. Which I guess I should have, because I did that for the main... Look at this. Look at this cutscene. Keep track of listens or screw-ups. Nah. But yeah. I'm just trying to get a little better at that. 
because I, I feel like... See, it's funny when, like, a streamer messes stuff up and they're like, oh, golly gee dang it, and they go crazy, but not when they try to, like, blame, I think. Anyway. I hope I remember which way I need to go here. I'm pretty sure I need to get into this forest first. And then I can do another skip somewhere. Uh, wish I knew which way was... I think left is the faster path. Sup, silly grandpa? How's it going? Just gaming. You know you know how we do. Just gaming. Hey, I don't know what to do here. Okay. Good to know that green Koopas fall down. Hey, if it's not uh, obvious, I have not played this game in a hot minute. <laughs> I don't think I've played this since it came out on the Wii U. Like, it's been a while. Yeah. I found a way to get super, new super, super Mario Bros. Wii with an emulator. That sounds illegal. I would never do emulators. 100% Mario 74 and it still sure has a difficulty spike. I'm in what? Oh, have y'all ever watched a speed run of Mario 74? Cause it's nuts. Hold on. There we go. Um, there's so many, so much speed tech in that game that just looks absolutely bonkers. Like if you dive, Flood actually propels you in a specific direction. The direction that you like spray flood at. So when you're at diving, flood is pointed behind you, which means if you spray, it propels you forward even faster than you were going already. So you go crazy stupid nuts. I was watching a speed run and it the game crashed at the very end and I think the kid was about to PB, which really sucks, but you know how it be. Anyway, I really do wanna play uh I really do want to play Mario 74. Like, a ton of people have wanted me to play it for so long, and I kept being like, nah, I just don't think it's that good. But, like, watching that, I might want to. Plus, if I remember correctly, in F3, which obviously uh, Kay's showed on his channel, his YouTube channel, F3 is E3 for fan games, if you don't know. I did normal 74. Wait. I'm literally talking about a completely different thing. I'm talking about, listen, I'm talking about Super Mario 63. And I now realize my error of completely talking about a completely different game. I'm so sorry. Anyway, I believe a kind of reimagining sequel is, uh, I mean, emulators are eh, illegal. They're not really illegal. No one's gonna arrest you, but... Like, for owning the emulator, nothing's gonna happen, but they can, like... Nintendo can take down sites that distribute it, basically. Uh, if I remember, what's the name of this? Bridge Over Poison Waters, that's the faster one. Um, I, the emulator itself isn't illegal, it's the ROMs. So... So, like, you'll never see, like, an emulator site taken down, but you'll see a, a ROM site taken down. Ooh, acorn. Told y'all. Wasn't even expecting it. Now I, I realize that I don't have my uh, midair spins anymore. Don't believe I need to get a secret exit here. Ah! Don't like that. You wish it hit me. You wish. Never. To a pro gamer like me, uh, like I told you, I studied, so I'm actually a pro gamer. It's probably another acorn, yeah. Too bad there's no uh, holdover like New Super Mario Bros. DS, which I say DS, it's just the regular New Super Mario Bros. Bada boom, bada bing, that looks like that's it. Yep. I'm not gonna get- listen. Listen. Oh shit, I got the uh I did a I did a gamer speed run. Uh-oh. I got the Oh look at this cutscene. If I get a game over, you're allowed to like You're allowed to unsub. And I know that's not a possible possible, but like it can happen. 
Cool. Just gonna ban you real quick. Good stuff. I play so many computer games that when I clicked to ban that chatter, which was just a follow for follow spam thing, by the way, not anything big. Um, when I clicked to, to like ban them and tried to click back into my game, I tried to like, I tried to like click back into the game as if it was a window that had closed, which y'all didn't know about that. Um, cause I play PC games so often. It's literally on my Switch and I tried to go to a third monitor that was my TV. Christ almighty. That skips like half the stage for free. But yeah, if I game over, uh, you have permission to unsub to me, uh, for free. You will get your refund. That sucks. It's fine, though. Would like to not lose my mushy, though. Is this gonna be an acorn? Yeah, buddy. Y'all thought. For free. Get connected. I don't know if those will hit me if I'm standing, but I'm not chancing it. Man, I forgot how good, like, having recently played all of the 2D Mario games, I now know how all of them feel compared to each other. I forgot how good the new Super Mario Bros. games feel. Like, this is smooth platforming, dude. If you click on a deleted message, you can see what it says. What's the point of deleting it then? What? That's weird. Oh, he lied. <laughs> I didn't know. I, I assume y'all tell the truth. Then I see a got dang kappa. I always assume the truth. I think the game might be a little loud. Down a tiny bit. Again, I tried to tab into my game. Oops. It's okay, I'm still an epic gamer. That's Boom Boom. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. We are over a fourth of the way through the game. You got godded. So I believe going into this forest, I need to immediately get another secret exit. Does Boom Boom count as advanced Koopa? I don't know. Let's see, look, another cutscene. Crazy. Hey, at least the speed- if I ever wanted to speedrun a game, this would be an easy one. <laughs> so many cutscenes. This would be a fun one to learn, actually. The game feels really good with a Pro Controller. If I'm gonna be honest. Sal lost his acorn to Koopa. Yeah, this is the one with the secret exit. Which way, Labyrinth? So hopefully I can remember how to do this. Where does this room go? This is the one. Wow, I got it first try. I believe this is the one I wanted to go to. Acorn. Nope. Koopa. Koopa. Thing is, the easier the game is to speedrun, the more the more contest you're gonna have with it. Like when you think of like Mario Bros. One, one of the shortest, and most optimized games out there. But like, you gotta deal with super fast. You basically gotta play a perfect game. But I don't think New Super Mario Bros. U has been that optimized yet. You can't quote me on that. I don't know how perfect the best speedrun is. For all I know, it could be frame perfect. I don't know. See you in a second, Randall. And that'll send a... Ugh. I love how you can just see the Van Gogh style over to the left. I'm so mad they didn't do more like that. Like, imagine artistic styles in every single stage or something. I don't know. I don't know. I just live here. Welcome to World 6, I believe. And also the hardest 
level in the game. I hate Parabeetle levels. It's also an auto scroller. Hat. So when you do hat, I either put on or take off the hat depending on whether I'm wearing it already or not. So uh, since I'm already wearing it, hat would have me take it off. And yes, I do need to add a description. I will do that. <laughs> Forgetting that. Many Yoshis are breaking the fourth wall by singing the song. I think that, yeah, this is the game where you step on eight of them and you get a free one up. And so you basically have like one ups just flying at all times if you're playing for, with four players. Man, I really want to play this with uh, Jamie and Ralph. That'd be so fun. We want to do it. The moment it was announced, we were like, we gotta do the deluxe version, but of course we haven't had a chance to get together since we did Mario Party. Especially because COVID didn't help. I really wanted to go visit them over the summer, but obviously that wasn't going to... We couldn't do that. We really wanted to play uh, Mario Party 2. 69? 69 what? Will we see more hat in the future, or will it be brand banished to the Shadow Realm? I could bring back 420, simply because I have a stream deck now, and I can just, like, you know, press a button. And you hear the bonk, except for some reason that only played half the bonk. I could bring it back. Uh, I want the hat to stay. Um, uh, oh, it was the coin count. It'd just be weird for the Mario hat to be on if we were streaming, like, I don't know, something that isn't Mario, you know? So it might be like a Mario stream only thing. I don't know. I think it's fun to add in these little things. I'm not getting star coins now. You don't need any. Um, because, uh, so star coins in this game don't unlock extra areas. They kind of just... They, they unlock World 9, which is completely optional. Hat for every game I've ever streamed. Hat for Overwatch. Yeah, I'll just get a collection of all these different hats. That would be a fun little... Uh, that would be really cool if you were able to, like, get just, like, dozens and dozens of hat. Also, thank you for the follow, silly grandpa. Dozens and dozens of hat, and whenever someone like donates the channel points or bits or whatever you want to have them, you just have a, you just have like, they can say which hat they want you to wear. Like, yeah, a helmet for Skyrim. There goes my, my acorn. That sucks. I think I need it in the next level. Rough. I also know it's used to make this level go faster. That's not an acorn. Ooh. Cloud. What else would there be? Wow, I'm gaming big now. And that probably would have been an acorn if I had my power up. Can I? Yeah, I can just run to the end now. Sweet. I don't need the acorn for anything if I remember right. It's merely a suggestion. Please, acorn. Yeah! Easy. I'm surprised how many times they give you acorn. I want... Oh man, I was gonna try say I want to try and skip this cloud segment, because surely it's possible. Oh, you can skip a good portion of it. Sweet. How's life been treating with COVID going around? Uh, it's not too different up here. I live in rural Maine. Rural, I can't say that, I'm a southerner. Um, I live in rural Maine, which basically means there ain't anybody here <laughs> to transfer it. Um, it's basically life is normal up here. The, the population density is so low that it's like, I believe in the county I live in, there's been three cases. And one was because there was a party. Another was because of a wedding reception. So you, like, it's almost like you have to actually actively try to do it. It's weird. 
I believe there's a secret exit in this stage to go straight to the boo house. Nope. Please, I need acorn. That's not an acorn. Oh! Oh, that was almost sick. Why? I didn't know that they had ice physics if they were frozen like that. Also, I love the gradient they have. Please, please, please. I suck. <laughs> oh my god, come on. There we go, that's what I wanted this whole time. Acorn, nope. Iced flower. Hold on, I don't think I almost said that. Not sure where you got that. Or maybe I did absent I don't know. I'm trying to be cleaner. Nope, you thought. No, that's three deaths. Yeah, in fact, my current job that I have is actually, I, I, I only have it because of the pandemic, and it's kind of the best job I've had in my life, so, you know, there's that. So, all in all, the pandemic's treating me quite positively, if I do say so myself, but, yeah, obviously that's not to say it sucks, because I do know people who have gotten it, unfortunately. So, not fun. Okay, I tried to throw ball. Also, I died right before the end. Gamer moment. Yo, why am I getting all of these? Leave. That's weird. I guess I need to ask a question. Well, yo, what do I do if, what, what, what should I do when I hit a thousand? Yeah, there goes another bot. Yeah, two in the same stream. I, I want to say the last time I got those were like two years ago, if I'm gonna be real. During one of the old ROM hack streams, I could really use a squirrel suit here, but I, I think I know where one spawns, so I should be able to do that. Um, this stage is so much quicker with a squirrel suit, so this kind of sucks. Oh my god. Don't know if I can still get one. Ay, 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 fire hot. I'm trying my best. If I don't die here, that's gonna be a victory on its own. Let's be honest. You get squished. Oh, stop. There's so much fire to bro. <laughs> okay. Another Kaizo hack for a thousand. Lost levels with my feet. Great suggestions so far. Any others? I don't know. Because I just did like a big old stream, right? So it's like, I don't want to just be like, oh, yay, 24 hour stream right after that. Because, you know, gotta make y'all want them. I believe this is a big one. Yep, there it goes. Get out of here. Well, that sucks. This mini boss is going to be a lot longer because of that. I think I should have just gone to the... Yeah, I should have just got... What's that? Gone to the left. Dude. Well, hopefully I can find another Akron. Cool. Cool. Hello? Where does that go? What's all this nonsense? I'm finding secrets. Sorry if I'm not looking at chat right now. Well, now I gotta... Yo, Drifts, thank you for the 500 bits. Holy moly. How's it going? On this fine evening. I didn't expect to see you so early because I think you stream really late. <laughs> go buy a matcha? I don't like matcha. Only Kellen likes matcha. 
Maybe I should be. A ROM hack stream for a thousand? Crazy. Who could have thunk? ROM hacks? Um, I don't know. I'm trying to think of something that would be special. See, if I had an acorn right now, I could fly upwards and just keep hitting Kamek without her doing this nonsense. So. Play a video game for a thousand? No. I'd rather not. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do a just chatting stream. Dude, do I have to wait for a second so she like uses magic? I don't think so. Bonk. Toho. Hello, how you doing? What's going on? There we go. There's Kamek. Play 3D All-Stars Sunshine. I want to do that anyway. I kind of want to just do that. I was thinking about almost doing it as a, another LP because Mario Sunshine is the only LP that I want to redo. It's also one of the few that I can redo. I was thinking about, I want to do a Yoshi Story uh, LP again, but only Melons. And I want to do Mario Sunshine because those two Let's Plays of mine are very low quality. I have my cat do her own story. Where'd she go? She left. Um, simple flips IRL BLJ for 1k. Can you take my matcha? I can take my matcha, but not my machi. So there's another secret exit that I need to get here. Um, take a guess if I remember which way to go. Sign you up for a new Sunshine LP. You got it. Coming right up. Couldn't have been a squirrel suit. Which way do I go? Hello? Thought it was upwards. Guess that's it. Yoshi's Story Melon Percent. I believe in the original Let's Play, I only got one stage with all melons. Um, which was the literal last stage I played in the entire game. I think I go in here. Nope, guess not. Love how some boos are just like munchy. Ah. Every K's hack on stream. How about any percent every K's hack? How's that sound? No, I could do uh, could do Last Impact again. I could try to do all of Last Impact in one series. Uh, is this the one where I go? There's like a... I don't know which way to go. I'm sorry. I might go the... I might actually end up getting the regular exit first and have to do it again. I'm pretty sure I know where the secret exit, though, is. This sends me where I... Yeah, so if I'm in here... Should be a way to drop down? Yeah, drop down through here. Go through the top, and there's a door here. I believe that's the secret exit. Well, Kay's hacks would be 70%. I mean, like, main hacks. Speaking of which, Kay's is doing another main hack. Uh, and it releases sometime soon... But of course I want that to be a let's play, because those get gnarly views. Shirtless, that is not allowed. On Twitch, except that's what Kay's does, so I'm sure that's why you said it. Boom. Boom. So, so far the stream in all together is 42 minutes. I don't know how much of that translate to the translates to the actual game. I'm trying to get better at saying my tenses correctly, too. Sometimes I just speak incorrectly on, like, a video, and someone will just comment, hey, that's improper grammar, and I just have to grin and bear it and be like, yeah, I meant for it to be improper. Can't cut off four minutes? I don't know. I spent a lot of time just getting this hat on. Didn't I? Thank you, Gendrifts, for the bits. I just looked over at my, like, activity feed, and I was like, oh, shit. 500 bits. Crazy. Ice floor. Right. Let's try to speed through this. Oh, that was sick. And then I messed it up. And I messed it up again. It's okay, we're fast. As long as I don't die here, I'm happy. Because this is a pretty tough castle. 
Second, this is literally the second to last world, by the way. So, yeah, it's gonna be a little bit difficult. Check a point. Cool, guess I'll get a mushroom. Yeah, don't, don't stun me. Cool. It's like, I like this because it feels like even though I've literally not practiced that, this at all, you can, it's so easy to go fast. Uh oh I thought I shocked myself there. Uh, secret mushroom. Yeah. This castle is pretty. The clouds in the background. That's one thing that Mario Bros. U really did right. We'll speak Kyogre and PMD DX and realize he had a Prima form and my game died in one fell swoop. I'm so lucky when I played that that I, like, I don't know, got acid ones. The one Koopaling fight, yep. Want something chill to play for a thousand, it would be followers. I could do Animal Crossing. That's right. I did play it. Yeah, it was release month the last time that I played on stream. I haven't been playing it daily recently. I've been almost like weekly because I kind of ran out of everything to do it. To do. Ah, thank you for the sub. <laughs> well, there you go. Um, I've done a lot of town renovate. Like, you'll see my town and you'll be amazed at how different it is, but it's also, like, still being renovated. So, like, I am in the middle of making that bad boy look good. Um, and I'm also trying to put a PMD mystery dungeon. PMD mystery dungeon. I'm trying to put a mystery dungeon, like, area in it. And it's kind of difficult because I'm making all of my own, like, floor textures for it. Um, and it's just taken a while. Also, I just hit, I, I hit an invisible block. You saw that, right? A little earlier. Oh my god. Five deaths now, baby. Animal Crossing, but you can use mints to make me do stuff. Twitch chat plays Mario 64. Hmm. A thousand subs. I never completed my run of uh, Mario 64 randomized, did I? That was very scary. I could try to do, uh, to complete a 100% run of Mario 64 randomizer, but I feel like people might have gotten bored of the randomized uh, gimmick at this point. I don't know, maybe that's just me. Rando was bleh, yeah. See, that's what I thought. I agree with you still think that the randomizer is a little bit like, uh, you know. Game's not really made for it. So. Is this gonna be a fire flower now? Baller. Wait, what? What did Simple Flips do? The chat plays? You'll enjoy anything. See, that's the thing. I know all of you would enjoy anything. It's like, a lot of you here right now, pretty much everyone here right now, is like, they come to every single stream, so I just want to know what y'all want to see for it, you know? Because, like, most of you will probably be there if I did a thousand follower special stream. So I just want to know what, what would really make y'all tick. Twitch chat plays Lost Levels. I mean, hey, that means I don't have to play it, so... For every new subscriber, I go back to 1-1. One, one. That'd be actually kind of fun. I don't know. I've, I've toyed around with the idea of doing, like, uh, the thing... What is it called when Twitch chat can, like, sabotage your runs? Why are they all real? Oh, because I need to hit them. Bonk. Because I think you can do that with channel bits or channel points. Not channel bits. Got him. Twitch chat idea sounds cool. Yeah. Redeem mints to make me lose a life or lose HP. Yeah. Crowd control. That's what it's called. Yeah, it'd be a really good uh, clickbait <laughs> clickbait title too because everyone loves doing those, but tw chat tries to kill me. Hey, guess what? I don't remember the path through this last world. And I'm definitely not looking up a speedrun right now. Definitely not doing that. Ooh, loud. 
Go in, Luigi. I think I have a good portion of a cutscene to go through here. Any percent cringe old ROM hacks that I haven't done videos on? You mean green stars? I'm just trying to get a view of the map so I see which path he takes. I, it's, it's just a singular path, isn't it? There's no secret areas. Luigi said ho. <laughs> Luigi said trans rights. Ooh, acorn. Wasn't there like a Doom Mario? I think so, yeah. My cousin's wedding, but Twitch tries to kill me. Because I'm also in the wedding. Ah! Completely forgot about this stage. React to my old videos. I would actually die. Like if I tried to watch my, let's let's say for instance, the Mario Party LP, which was my first LP. Um, ouch. That'd be rough. Oh, this isn't gonna end well. All right, see ya, Cedar. I won't win, I guarantee you that. What if if you lost this level, he just yeet you away? Yeah, that's an insta-kill. I definitely didn't know that. The roughness makes it better. Uh, who was it? Is it one of y'all that was going through all of my old videos? Because someone's, like, been going through... They commented on half of, like, the Mario Party ones because they've been going through, and I just... Ugh. I don't know how y'all stand it. I can't. Like, I'll say, like, everything Chrono Trigger and Past were decent quality for me. For that, though. Oof. Oof, buddy. Really, it's uh, getting a better mic that really did it. Because, uh... Get it when I got my snowball at the very end of Chrono Trigger. Like, the quality difference is, like, night and day. You did binge them all last year. Good. Great. Awesome. Yeah. I, I'm, I think I might... <sighs> Sometimes I don't remember which order I did some of the LPs in. Diddy Kong Racing I remember not being too bad to go rewatch. Fake. Got him I don't want to get caught behind him again. I'm deathly afraid. VTuber stream? Isn't that like... I have no idea how they do that. I think it'd be funny to do you to do like a shy guy and just do like the whole stream. And then have live captions that say what you're saying. You need a second person to do that. That would actually that'd be a good April full stream. Oh shit, now I wanna do it. Is this actually gyro? It is. I didn't know that. Gyro feels so good with the, uh, the Pro Controller. Keep that one on the back burner. Yeah, I, I haven't had an April Fool's, uh, April Fool's stream idea before. Live 2D, that's the program that people use for it. I've seen people, like, here's the thing. So y'all know how, uh, Pokimane is doing it? You probably don't know how Pokimane's doing it because it's Pokimane, and that's completely outside of my viewer base, but, um... She literally got, like, uh, someone to just make her as, like, an av- Like, she's a 2D avatar, um, and she had- She commissioned someone to just make her as a 2D avatar, and she uses that, and that- I feel like that kind of gets rid of the point, you know? Hi, Mario fan, how you doing? On this fine Wednesday afternoon. You're just about at the end of New Super Mario Bros. U. But it's like, I like the ones that go like, ooh, one that I watch. It was on the Philip DeFranco show. It was like breaking news. I have no idea why. Um, anyway, uh, there's one VTuber that I watch. I think I watch like a few of them. Uh, but one that I watch uh, has a different, has a different avatar for whether they're doing a mic stream or a micless stream. Thank you for the follow, Mario fan. Glad you're having a good day. Um... So they have like one that has white hair for a stream without a mic and one with black hair uh, for a stream with a mic. Fox girl as my avatar. He covers YouTube Twitch people, but it's, I don't know. 
That seems like not a, such a non... Hold on, is there a... Yeah, I thought so. It seems like such a non-newsworthy thing, but it was like such a big deal. <laughs> I don't know. So I saw some people that were like, oh, it's a pro like that. I saw a lot of people saying that you shouldn't do VTubing if you have previous, like if you're comfortable with using your webcam. Because one of the big things about VTubers is a lot of them do it because they're not comfortable appearing on screen. Um, which I get, but I don't know. Infinite Let's anyway. see if I can not suck here. Bomb! Oh! There's a hole there now. I think the bombs destroy the floor, don't they? They do. They at least hurt it. Ah! I didn't expect you to be there. There goes half the ground. All right. Oh, it comes back. Good. Oh, that that absolutely shoots you off. Please, 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 thank you. The V and VTuber stands for Vixen, like Fox Girl. I don't know. What's my VTuber soda? It might just be a Shy Guy, but then I feel like I'm taking from uh, Trainer Shy Guy. Whomst we did the... Uh, Oh no, is there more? Whomst we did Fall Guys with. Vixen was more synonymous with Witch. Uh, I, no, I think it... It's like Fox because it's like... Oh, you're so tricky, you know? You'd, you'd call like uh, an old-timey... How do I say this? An old-timey seductress, like, oh, you vixen, because they're tricking you. Am I right on that? I think I'm right on that. Yee. World 8, baby. I don't think we've passed the hour point. That feel when you thought Foxtrot was Neko, but for Fox Girls. Oh, no. Oh. For it. Oh, no. World 9 is hidden. Yes, it is. We will not be doing World 9 today. Um, just completing the game. Amber Gooch. You're not kidding. Oof. Poof. Yeah, I don't... Dude, is, is there a secret path that you go on this for the speedrun? Cannot tell. Nope, you go the main path, I think. Because there is a secret path, but I think the main path is just faster. So that's what we do. Walks in place the stream. There you go. Uh, I think my favorite parts of the new Super Mario Bros. games are always the uh, lava worlds, because they always add in weird mechanics. Like, the meteors falling down is just great. Love that so much uh and that was actually in the first new super mario bros but like there's certain enemies that only appear in the last world like uh the bats in the original new super mario bros love that actually no there were crows that flew at you i'm, not, I'm gonna play this safe I'm not trying to die here okay i'm gonna play this safe i say as i stand on the only platform with a thousand meteors coming down on it it just dips in for a hot second. It's not even a hot second. Uh -huh. It's not even like long enough to even be a threat. Yeah, I believe if you go up there, that leads to the secret exit, but it's slower. Baller. Oh man. I really wish that my computer used Bluetooth so I could use this pro controller on PC games. I swear the Pro Controller for the Switch is the best feeling controller I've ever felt. Mainly because it has all the gyro in it and it makes it really heavy compared to like the Wii U Pro Controller, which is like way too light, in my humble opinion. Do I have to actually do the bone correctly? Surely there's a trick for skipping all of this. Oh, look at this. 
get out of here. Do these, do the Goombas actually hurt? I think they just slow me down. The Bluetooth adapter won't work. It will. I just haven't gotten one, basically. I got a, uh, I got a cord that, you know, USB-C cord. Apparently just generic USB-C cords won't work. You actually do need to get like a, one that's specifically for the Switch controller to connect it to the PC. Because it works automatically with Steam games. I know this for a fact. Freeze the blards. But yeah. I should die immediately. You're right, though. The shake control still works. Yeah, they just do whatever. I don't know. You can just spin to get them off. Honestly, just running straight into them, into them is the best way to get them away. Blard. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah, I'm not gonna hit that. <laughs> don't worry, I won't die anymore, so you won't even have to do anything. Please be a power-up. God bless. Oh, come on. I hate... That's what I remember being a problem with this game. A lot of people were angry that the jump button was also a spin button. I find myself spinning so much when I don't mean to. Because it's absolutely, like... If you're trying to press the B button to get extra height off of a jump when you hit an enemy, you accidentally spin and it just kind of ruins you. So... It really sucks. You can turn that off! Ugh. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I should have done that. I completely forgot it was a thing, because it was, like... It was just a controversy that was so long ago, and Nintendo does dumb stuff every day, so it's like, you for kind of forget half of it. Rising Tides of Lava. You know. Simple game. Easy game. Oh, I'm so glad that this platform isn't covered by lava. Yeah. Ooh. I like how you can see where the lava reaches up because it shows it. There we go. Beautiful. Sure, there's a much more optimal path. Like, these levels... F Oop. These levels feel so much fun because you can kind of like speed through these ones. They're so huge and open, but still difficult somehow. Like, look, there's nothing here and it feels good to just run. Uh-oh. Yikes. Oh, I thought it would bounce. I should hear, hold L stick on the title screen. You should hear Nabbit make a noise. I was so sure I was gonna bounce off of it like it was still an enemy, but it turns into a platform when it's on lava. I didn't know that. <sighs> I was so sure that the ground was gonna be so high. Well, get your counting in, baby! Uh, here we go. Man, those loading screens look so slick. I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this. Nope! Nope! Oh my god. See, now I'm just gonna mess everything up. That's how this is gonna go. Nine! How many lives do I have? Seven. Yeah, like I said, if I get a game over in this game, it's like, you get so many extra lives. That'd be just silly. Okay, let's raise this up all the way, I guess. Make that a much easier path. Uh, I definitely don't need that. Gamer mode. Okay, that's safe. Don't like that. Ah, oh, jeez. Please. Yes. I know I disappoint you, but I disappoint everyone, so get used to it. Bonk. 
I like how I got claps just for collecting a line. Oh, I did it again. Made it. 255. That's something squared. Is that 12 squared? No. I don't know. Well, there you go. Another firework. I'm a bad speedrunner. I'm so sorry. I think there's like one level where if you do it optimally, you actually need to pot 15 squared. I knew I knew it was something squared. There's that knowledge coming in. All those all those uh college math class classes. Cuz I like time to brag. Uh I passed all my math classes and not much else. 15 no. 15 is 225. Maybe it's not something squared. Uh-oh. -uh. Oh, okay. <laughs> the coins are obstacles. It's okay. None of us knows know our squares tables. Bro. Anyway. How y'all doing? I think we've hit just about an hour now in the run, so it's officially not a great speed run. Unfortunately, if those nine deaths didn't tell you anything. There you go. Uh, isn't... Can't you, like, go past the finish in this level, or am I... I think I'm thinking of a new Super Mario Bros. Wii stage. Uh-oh. Because there's a level where you can go past, like, the very top, and it just gives you good, good. Oh, no. Oh, I thought I lost it for a second there. Nope, gotta get rid of you. Stop being a great speedrun when I died in the first level. No, I think that was still... I think that was actually the optimal strat now I think about it. Oh, I was trying to hit the other one with it. It's fine. Maybe if I just... freeze the lava, it won't get me. Should have reset. I think it'd be funny if you, uh, I think it'd be funny if, like, the world record of the game had a flawless run, except they died in the very first level. And they had to, they would have to do it with, for the pur with the purpose of, like, it being funny. Because otherwise they'd just die in the first level and reset. But they'd just be, have to be like, alright, this is going to be world record and I'm going to die in level one. Alright, good stuff. Lava rises. Throw one ice ball to stop. Wait, does it actually work like that? Nuts. I was just goofing. New boot goofing. Made it. Yo, this game looks so good. <laughs> it's so pretty. Makes me really want to get the 3D World remake, remake, uh, port. Well, are we gonna say remaster? I don't know what term we gotta use for that. Is this the last stage or not? Nah? I don't remember. I guess we're gonna find out. It says the final battle, I'm assuming. <laughs> I'm assuming it's the final level. So, like, with this route, we probably could have done this game at the end of the last stream. Wow. Speedrun, but need to die once for fun. You could be the world record leader in this obscure category because I make it up. See, that's the thing about speedrun categories. Can you just do whatever you want? Make up whatever you want? Because that's the fun, isn't it? Ooh, no. We need to make sure that this doesn't surpass the Super Mario Land death count. Because that was 11. Can I incapacitate him or not? I don't think I can. I almost fell right into the lava. Nope. Doesn't do a thing. There he is. There he is. Oh, that makes the whole platform fall. All right. I... I'm sure he breaks straight through the bricks. There's not a lot of room for moving. 
re-release with new content. Probably like port with DLC included, kind of in that area. Bye -bye. Incorrect. I now have a world record in speedrun where you die 11 times. I'm sure someone's ran the game with 11 deaths. Like, surely, like, someone, like, who's learning and marking their PVs, they're like, ah, well, this isn't my greatest run, but I did it fast. There's also got, like, the fun part of that would be figuring out the optimal ways to die, because I think that would just be funny. Oof, he's so quick. Surprisingly fast. Oh, I thought he was... I thought he couldn't land in the lava. I thought that was the whole thing. He had to land on a platform. Thanks for the lift, buddy. There's definitely a hidden uh, thing on that last platform. Yo, checkpoint. Is this the short... This has got to be the shortest final level in a new Super Mario Bros. game. I'm going to keep mentioning the DS one because I love the DS one and it's like one of my favorite games of all time. That's not true, but it's one of my favorite games on the DS. Um, its final level is like a super hard puzzle. I actually have to go under him. Yo, sup? Oh! Jumping. I like how they give him a huge wind up. You have to die in each level once without getting a game over. Let's see, how many... So I've died 11 times and I still have 7, eight, seven lives. So that's... That's 18 deaths. I don't even think we go through 18 levels in the whole game, so you could probably do that. I wish I was higher up on my webcam, but I didn't set it up to be like that. Unfortunate. Anyway, final Bowser battle. We're gonna do this in like an hour and five minutes, I think, is going to be the time. I really wish I had set up my live split for this. Because I literally have it set up for the game. I just didn't open it because I was like, ah, I want this to be quick and easy. Nice JPEG of Peach in the background. That looks like a Mario Party JPEG. It's so low quality. Oh, it's an actual model. I would have never guessed. Like, it's like, it very much looked like one of those screens, like, after you win or lose a minigame, and they're like, they do a little pose, like Yoshi licks his eye. I don't know. Big boy. Daddy-o. Oh, now I can't even think about this part without the Balzette mod coming into mind. Hardcore gameplay. I don't know how you speedrun this part. You just gotta do it. I'm glad it gave me button prompts because I absolutely did not know what to press. You gonna jump again there, bud? You gonna jump again there, bud? Thanks. <laughs> Jesus. Get luigi down. I like how the, the chunky hammer bros, uh, Jumping and pounding the ground makes you stunned, but this gigantic Bowser doesn't. I really like the lighting effects that they do on him. Man, this looks so good. It's just ridiculous. Bonk. Oh! Oh! I didn't think that would happen. Last place on speedrun leaderboard is hour and eight minutes, minute 30. I feel like if I did this again just one more time, I could beat that. That'd be fun. Oh boy. Oh, I'm glad that just bonks. Get out of here. Oh, double trouble. Oh, that was so close. Hey, see ya. Oh no. That's not good. Jesus! Okay. I'm a pro gamer. If I do this entire fight without getting hit, I'm honestly going to be impressed with myself. <laughs> Just so y'all know. Because I've had some close calls. Come on down, buddy. 
I almost ran right into that bomb, and that would have been just icing on lay cake. Oh! All right. Oh, he's tired. Funk. And split. Right? That's it? I don't remember if there's, like, secret second fight. Anyway, gamer moment. We just did it. <laughs> that That's it. I have no idea where my cat went. I think my cat's getting used to being on the couch, which is nice because she'll actually spend time with us. Yeah, we just... W Look at Bowser Jr. We just killed his dad, and he's just like... Papa? Yeah, you're an orphan. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Bye-bye. Yo, this looks pretty. There's Nabbit. Why is this ice themed? I feel like the only other time they kind of make Princess Peach's castle ice themed is in Mario Tennis Open. That's a pull. There you go. We did it. That was easy. <laughs> that was the easiest game we did. See, I kind of wish I added the new Super Mario Bros. games to that set of uh, games we did for the marathon because easy. Plus, we had 11 deaths, so we actually tied with Super Mario Land, surprisingly. Yeah, it's like, if I hadn't just done a 2D Mario Marathon, I definitely think we would have, uh... Here, let me actually do something real quick. Go here, and I can add in this to, like, the corner. So we can watch it, but I can be, like, main thing on the screen. Anyway. Peach's Castle and Mario Baseball and the Wii is an ice skating ring. Well, they do that often then, don't they? Oh, I hate how Elgato just has, like, these little black bars on the edge. I've been wanting an Elgato HD 60. Because right now, anything I record that's in HD um, is 30 FPS because games suck. Anyway. That's Vibio game. Kitty. Um, anyway. That's the whole game. Yeah, I still, I just wanna, uh, I think we can just talk a little bit more about what I should do for a thousand follows, because we have some ideas. We have the, which side am I moving here to? I, yeah, so I don't block the game. Uh, I could try to set up the whole Twitch control crowd control Mario 64. Thank you. But uh, that would be a first, so that would be fun to try and do. Yeah, I just need something to do for a thousand. Uh oh. Gimme kitty. Oh, there she is. Oh, that's a claw in my arm. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Baby. She's just leg out. Cat. Luigi's face was injured. Cat. Anyway, I'm going to say anyway a thousand times. So we have the Twitch control or crowd control Mario 64. Uh, we could do a K's hack. I could do Last Impact again. I think it would be fun to do like that in a whole a whole stream like of that whole game. Because I, I think I quite like playing through entire games in a single sitting. Because uh, it kind of gets rid of that, oh no, I need to come back and play this game. Obviously it won't work for some games like Skyrim, unless I'm like a hardcore speedrunner. But um, you know how we did the uh, the 24 hour stream and I literally did the entirety of Star Revenge. Uh, what was it? 6.25? That was enjoyable. And I'd like to do something kind of like that again.